what is going on everybody how are you guys doing welcome back to the channel welcome back to collecting have you guys know i'm john i'm the host of these shenanigans and shenanigans we will get up to but before we do gotta say it if you guys are a first time viewer second time viewer how many ever times you've been to my channel and you've not yet subscribed hit the subscribe button join the tens of followers of collecting havoc we're out here having fun make sure you guys are hitting that like button and uh you guys are doing great in the comments uh seeing some old faces again some new faces uh some regulars keep it up down there i, I really enjoy reading them uh, i like some of the interaction between the commenters uh guys helping each other out that is awesome so uh keep it up so with these comments you guys, we're in the third quarter of the year. We're uh, five months away from the rest. I think we got, what, four and a half months, give or take? So let me know, what is your must-have figure of the year so far? Do you guys have a, a, a best figure? Is there something that you have to have that we should all know about? Let me know down in the comments. So, that out of the way. While you guys are writing that comment, you guys, I don't got much to say. All my housekeeping, all my wrap-up, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it at the end. Because we'll talk about the podcasts I got coming up. We'll talk about some toy shows coming up, some toy shop visits. But we'll talk about those at the end. For now, let's go look at some toys. What do we got going on here? What do we got going on here? Nothing. Absolutely the same stuff we see every time I'm here. <laughs> now, you know what, though? At least it's stocked. Like, this is newer. This is newer. This is old, old, newish, old, old. Hi, Pee-wee. So there's stuff here. If you're looking for it, this is always kind of your backup if you can't find it at your Targets and Walmarts. Got a little bit here. Plus, I mean, I have some pretty good Lego sets over here. Looks like all the Dune sets are finally gone. The Ornithopter, that thing was beautiful. How is this thing not moving after all this time? I thought this was like a popular set, but just me. All right, I'm going to go see if they actually got anything new here. I've been hearing uh, Myers has been getting a couple new items here and there, but that's cool. Hopefully, we'll find something. Oh, check that out. Something new. Oh, wow. Okay. Look at that. That's a new line. Face plates. Got the 3D maneuvering gear. It's actually pretty cool. How how articulated is it? And they have all four here. Ooh, there's a chainsaw man too. Let's see. And they're only I think they're only 16 bucks. Uh, it doesn't look like they have Chainsaw Man. Nope. That's cool. That's a mate. That's a definitely down the line. Cause I want. I want all the. I'll get all the Attack on Titans. Nice, cool little TV. That's cool. All right. So first, something new we've seen in a minute. It's actually a completely new line. All right, what do we got for wrestling? Eh, same old, same old. Belair, Lashley. Yeah, those are oh, been around for a minute. Cleaned it up. They got some of the new Transformers here, but I'm not seeing anything new as far as Legends, Hasbro. Oh, check that out. They got the Ghost here now. So they're starting to slowly roll some new stuff out. B-Wing. Oh, 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 look at this bad boy. Oh, two of them. What? What is this? The Skywalker, Luke Skywalker, Holger. Oh, cool. What else they got in here? Ooh. Nope. Regular stuff. But that is awesome. Check that out. I think Figure Fever just got a new addition to his collection. And I'll give him the better looking one. This one's kind of beat up. Check. That is awesome. Dude, that actually looks pretty cool. <laughs> no, I don't have room for these, but these things are pretty cool. 
So we'll grab this and then uh, I think that's it. Nothing else is here. That's, that is a win for this stop. Looks like the slow restock continues. GHB Paranormal Ghostbuster or Paranormal Plushies. Wonder what those are. Hmm. They're closed. I don't want to open them. We'll have to see what happens when they come out because I don't see any Ghostbuster themed plushies there. But yeah, looks like a minimal restock today. They added, oh, another glider. God, I have so many gliders. I don't know if I actually need another one. I gotta grab one of those. Uh, EC said he wanted one. They got the legends down here. We still have plenty of stealth. Captain Carter, some more what if figures. Plenty of Ant Man's. Bo Katan's, Hans. Still got plenty of these for five. Cat Mario and uh, comic. So that's cool. These things are kind of fun. I, I grabbed one. They're kind of fun. They're all different ways to kill unicorns. <laughs> Tons of King Valkyries, which is ironic because that was the last one I needed to get the build that bath. And yeah, I played the super long game and lost. Because I ended up paying 12 instead of 10. I mean, I know it's whatever. <laughs> Oh, looks like she's new. I think she's new. Still haven't seen the other one that goes with uh, Dr. Evazan. I can't think of his name right now. Lando's finally showing up. More Lando's. Look at I got more Lando's to look for. Lando's and Mandalorian. So Lando's and Mando's. Plenty of the Golden Archives. Ric Flair still hanging up. We hanging up, hanging out. Got some woos. Nakia's, just some random, there's plenty of Gamoras to go around for everybody. So there's still some stuff to find. It just depends on what you need. All right, I think I'm going to go see if there's anything else here. If there is, you know, I will let you know. Short round. All right, once again, time for a collecting havoc voiceover. Anyways, there's some new uh, Star Trek in there. You see C-3PO, got the Vader, saw Luke in there. I don't know why it's going so fast. Huh. Do I got the audio? I got the audio right. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I was talking to people and trying to get out of there, and I wasn't finding anything at this point. So, hmm. Yeah, it's got that new Batman figure. That was kind of cool. And then, uh, check it out. I found anime Batman in the collector's edition. And got Superboy there. Aquaman. Some of them look newer. That's Alfred Pennyworth. Got the new Robin. Looks kind of good. It's a little, I don't know, it's kind of weird looking, but it's not bad. So, anyways. I got the pink Riddler. Yeah, I finally realized what I'd found there. Saw him again. And yeah, the, the Legends though, man. Look at this. I'm just not getting the new Legends around me at all. I mean, there's a couple cool ones left there, but still. I got Kevin Spacey. I didn't even bother. I just kind of cut the camera. I'm like, ugh, that's it. And we got some statues from Toddy Mac. Some of the newer Transformers starting to hit. Look at that masterpiece right there, though. That's freaking awesome. It's a good-looking one from the, I believe, Bumblebee movie. Vipers everywhere. That's one I am surprised we have not seen it in Ollie's. Got the GoBots 3-pack there. But yeah, the Vipra, why have we not... We haven't seen it at any retail. That's a cool figure. That's Skywarp. I don't know if that's brand new, but that looks good. I uh, got the Flash statue. Check that out. I think that was the first time at, at the point I had seen that. Got him. And look at... We got Adam over there. Uh, I was looking to see what else is back there. Got that Superman. That's looking good. And there's ambush bug there, so that was kind of cool. But yeah, I mean, I'm where's where's my where's my new Marvel Legends? I, and I had talked to him at this point, and he said they got one new legend this week, and it was the Colossus and Juggernaut two pack, and it was already gone before I got there. 
he said it had sold to uh, like a, the day before. But that was the only New Legend they got for the entire store for the whole week. One two pack. I mean, how are we supposed to buy this stuff if it's not in the store? What the heck? Come on, Hasbro, get with the program. Get with the program. You got Transformers on the pegs. You got Joes on the pegs. Let's get it. Let's get it done. And then, of course, got to end with the pops here. But man, one of these days, I'm gonna find that Ichigo uh, Chase. I know Blair has it, but again, I need to find it in the wild before I go and pay somebody for it. <laughs> but yeah, this this wasn't a bad stop, as you saw. A lot of the new Toddy Max stuff was here, so it was. That was kind of the coolest part. A uh, couple cool pops we're seeing. But other than that, everything else is kind of status quo. But, I mean, it's worth stopping by. Catch you in the next store. Oh, well, we'll try from this side again. No ghost. But they got, no, they got some new, the new squadrons we're finding. Oh, awesome. So this is what they look like. Oh, wait, I did find these already. Nah, not for fifty five not for fifty bucks though. If these go on sale, I might grab one, but not at full price. These need to be like thirty this is like a thirty dollar set. These don't even equal a full figure. This is not even this is three quarters of a figure, so one and a half. So thirty bucks. Then we got Mandos and Landos. But this is a good start, so because we got these <laughs> fake lightsabers you got your red and of course your greens the real sabers more squadron but hopefully with them finally putting something new over here the rest of the store has some new stuff and oh hey some new stuff over here check this out finally somebody's stocking something in the toy aisle Although, these are a little late to the party. Everyone else has had these for months. But we got Raph and Leo. That's kind of cool, but I'm still passing. A couple of these left. Hopefully they restock and we get a sale because I need to finish Metal Bottle. Oh, check it out. So this case pack is Tumor Man, Stratos, and a Triclops. I got him from Big Bad Toy Store because I didn't know these were actually going to hit retail. I paid $17.99, so it's not like I paid a different price. Um, we got some play sets, so that's new here. Yeah, the wrestling's looking a little weak. Any empty boxes? Empty boxes? Empty boxes? No, no, no empty boxes. But we got Jamal, lots of Jamals, and a Rosie. Bubba Rogers, the chase is right on top. Uh, they don't, this one still does not have the Hogan's. What is up with that? Hmm. But anyways, that's kind of what this toy aisle looks like. So that's it. And then, uh, remember behind us, oh, they got the, now they're up to six of these now. See, they got those, I think that those two are new. But all this used to be all Pokemon cards. Oh, 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 lanky box. Oh. This used to be that little overflow NECA section. There's a fart gun there. But yeah, so they're, they're definitely changing things up a bit. So we'll see what we find. Oh, we got Cat Luigi. And some, yeah, they're not done. Oh, found another Leo. So we got Sonic from that maze. Got Nux. So yeah, all right, my suit's on the other side. Yeah. We got Laser Light Optimus Prime. That's new here. Oh, right in the feelings. That's some, that's going to... Oh, what's the word? Um, Post-traumatic stress disorder for some kids my age. <laughs> a ton, they're going full bore on this one. I don't think they learned their lesson from this Earthspark stuff. Uh, bring it out slowly until people actually like it because all this stuff is going to end up at Ollie's and Ross none of it I mean like none of this moved at all so I mean I'm glad they didn't do any of them in the studio series line which they did for Optimus Prime which is fine Optimus Prime looks good we got this guy's 60 bucks I don't even know he's supposed to be down here we got a couple of these 
for 50 bucks, so I'm going to pass. Those guys are here. Primal, Batzaro, Bizarro. We got the little place at the living room, Ecto 1. Oh, and you can see the Batmans we got, which none are chases. Check that out. Five Warbirds. Nice. So those should do not pay scalper prices for those. They are out there. You will find them. So I've heard a couple getting restocked, so check them. The whole family to fit the display. They got two of these guys left. Oh, well, mine actually, most of them that I've been finding are only, uh, they must have only put out one case, but every one of these are sitting. If I even want this, just for the loadouts, I'll play long game on that one. Still no um, tiger paw. Um, but yeah, look at all this, all this got bigger. So all this gujitsu stuff and stuff that just sits got a bigger section. And they crammed all this into three, four foot sections where it used to be for five four foot sections. So they lost four feet on this last reset. It's kind of a bummer, but this is what they got. All right. They re well, I was here before. I restocked these guys. We've already seen these. Ooh, barely on the peg. They're so heavy. But we already have this, so we don't need to worry about it. All right. I don't think that's going to stay up there, but they had it, so no, it's not going to stay. That was going to end up falling. But also, we got... Bam, he finally showed up here too. So that's cool. All right. Did that while I was off looking at NECA, so that's kind of cool. So we got Bumblebee and Red Hulk. Forgot about, about this. They actually do have, they used to have five of these, so these actually moved here. I'm, I'm shocked. Because the Joker mobiles that I've been finding haven't moved at all. Then we got these, which is just him and Bane. They look all right. So, seven, for seven bucks, they're not bad. And then, I'm pretty sure these are re-releases that they just stuck back out. So, all right. I know there's still a NECA end cap here. We'll look for clearance and see if there's actually something in NECA looking for clearance stuff. Found this, but I'm going to put it back. This is sitting over by the price checker. This is probably, this one's probably going to go to clearance. It's pretty bad. Oh, here's the clearance on or NECA uncap. Nothing different from last time. Rabbit's still sitting. Guys, we're gonna wrap up the hunt right there. Uh, <laughs> I know it was in a long hunt, but I haven't I didn't have time to really hunt this week. Uh between sorting out videos for the shows, the t all that stuff, editing what I actually had. I mean that took up a lot more time than I thought. That's the that's the downside of this whole thing is editing. Ah, it takes forever. <laughs> Anyways, you guys. Whew. I still found stuff, though. Um, Ollie's was kind of meh for once. Uh, GameStop had all the, some of the new Toddy Mac stuff. That was cool to see. Uh, where are the legends at? I mean, until we get to Target. <laughs> Target uh, definitely won this hunt. We had the restock of the Warbirds. We had the Red Hulks again. They just, they had a lot of different stuff there, except NECA. I didn't even film NECA. I, I looked over there, and I'm just like, ugh. I just, I, I, I couldn't bring myself to film it, so. Oh, well. Anyways, um, even Meyer, uh, that Oak Creek Meyer had some good stuff. Uh, had those new anime figures. Uh, we, what was it? Uh, there was the Aaron Yeager from... Attack on Titan, and there was a couple others. Those look really good. Different face plates, different uh, hands. Uh, it even had the full 3D uh, maneuver built maneuver gear. I, oh, what the the stuff. You know what I'm talking about from Attack on Titan. It had that full thing. That thing looked awesome. Um, and I think it was only $17. That's, that's insane. Uh, next time I actually see one, I'm going to take a little better look. I might grab one just to try it out. Um, but I was in a hurry and 
for whatever reason, didn't think to grab one because I wanted that Aaron Yeager. I, I saw somebody posted online that was similar to Anime Heroes, but maybe a little better. I don't know. You guys tell me down in the comments if you guys know anything about that line. I'm kind of interested to know a little bit more. Um, other than that, there was not a whole lot going on in terms of brand new stuff. I didn't even... I went to two Walmart, three Walmarts this week. Nothing. Not even not, not even worth pulling my phone out of my pocket to check. So there's no Walmart in this one. Sorry, guys. Ross has been dead for about two weeks in my area, so nothing to film at Ross. And I went to like three or four of them in the past week. So, yeah, hopefully Ross picks back up. It'd be nice to find some of the goodies that everybody else is finding. Uh, what? The Cover Girl. I still haven't found Strife. I haven't... I haven't even found the breakfast cereal stuff in the stores yet. The one I have, I traded for at a toy show, as you know, at Kane from Blair. Thank you, Blair. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, anyways, that's enough of the recap. On to the housekeeping stuff that's coming up. So, August. Nothing next weekend. I'm uh, it's mainly just toy hunting this week. I uh, got some stuff going on. Uh, but the weekend after is the Kenosha Toy Show. I will be there. Um, got I made some deals. I gotta um, either pick up or pay off. You know, so gotta make I gotta make appearance. <laughs> Plus, I like the guys there. Everybody's there. That is pretty cool. I enjoy the show. It's two miles from my house. Why wouldn't I go? So plus, uh, I will actually be recording a podcast with those guys. Uh, like, I've been talking about it. Um, hopefully, by either the next episode or by Thursday or Sunday's episode, I will have more information. I'll have links letting you know where it's going to be. Um, I'm not going to be a normal part of this podcast. I'm just guesting on it. But if it goes well and they want me to stop back again sometime, I'm, I'm up for it. So, it be something fun to do. You know, local and all that good stuff. So, anyways. Um... So that's that. Uh, September, we got Mighty Con in Milwaukee. Uh, that's one of the bigger, bigger toy shows in Wisconsin. I will be there. Um, I, I always find a couple goodies there, so it's always worth a stop. And then uh, we get into October. We get the fall, fall edition of Kane County, and that's the big show, aside from spring. <laughs> so that's what's coming up. We got, um, And then in between all that stuff... Uh, we got a, we found a couple toy shows or toy shops that Lucas and EC want to hit, so we'll be trying to hit some of those. Hopefully everything goes good and we can time it out right because, dude, as you guys can tell, I have a blast hanging out with those guys, so I'd like to hang out with them more, do some more filming with them, and just have a good time hanging out with guys that enjoy toys, man. The heck? Anyways, um, I'm running late, so I don't have time to get to the toy table, but I promise... The next toy table that we do will be great. Got the toy show. I'm doing a Burnham Bowl, so hopefully some stuff to pick up there. Uh, got Ollie's. I'm sure I'm going to find something in the next week or two. And I got a couple mail calls I got to grab, so just nothing's here yet. So one of the next episodes, I promise, we'll have a toy table. We'll look at some of the pickups that I got that weren't at a toy show or a toy shop. I haven't done that in a while, have we? So anyways... Thank you guys for hanging out. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Join the tens of followers of Collecting Havoc. And uh, catch you guys in the next one.